Welcome back to Tahoe Today. It's 8.05. Time now to head back out to Truckee and check in with Linda Atkins. She is at Jack's at the Tracks. Hey, Michelle. We are in Truckee, the heart of Truckee at Jack's at the Tracks. This is so cool, this diner. And it's all about the experience here. I'm sitting in this cozy booth in this darling diner, and I have Bud Haley here, owner. Bud, this is such a great experience. You know, Linda, thanks. I mean, at the end of the day, what is going out to a meal? It is about the experience. Yeah. There's a lot of good food options out there. Yeah. I think clearly you'll see what our food's all about. It's truly amazing, yeah. but it is the experience. It's coming in and feeling very comfortable where you are, not ostentatious, but yet you can get a truly spectacular meal here. But it's literally the fun, it's the vibe, it's the energy that this place has to offer, so it's really pretty cool. It is, and I want to talk about the location, because the location is right here, right off of, what, 267 or, you know, Old Brockway Road coming right in. Talk about your location right here. I mean, you can't miss it. Yeah, it's great. It's right on the tracks. I mean, you can't miss it. It's yes. true. I mean, the, the train literally comes within 20 yards of our patio. So, I mean, you feel the rumble, and it's an exciting thing for anybody. Everybody loves trains. So the location's perfect, and it's really a neat, neat location for getting access to and just for anybody cruising through town. Yeah, it, it's so great. We had a couple here we were just talking to that are that stopped through through 80 on their way to Milwaukee, Wisconsin. So how cool was that, talking to those people? It's amazing. Yeah. You know what's amazing right now is all the burners are coming to town. Yeah. And everybody's got to stop at Jack's if you're a burner. We do a burner special. Okay. We, give them, we give them a little discount. You know, you know yeah. who they are usually. Yeah. And uh, so, so we're burner friendly. And, uh, you know, it's just there's people from all over the country that stop here because we've been on the Food Network at least three times a year for the last four years yeah. on diners, drive-ins, and dives. So it really helps promote the business, and it people does. can see really everything we're about. It's kind yeah, of fun. That's so true, and the food. I'm getting ready to have a, a nice meal here. I don't know what you got got cooking back there, but Jaime, your chef is awesome. Yeah, Jaime is amazing. Well, we're going to do a chicken and waffle special with our hand-breaded panko-crusted chicken. It's just amazing. Oh, wow. um, we do our thing called the all-day addiction, which is literally now becoming a nationally famous dish that you can't get anywhere else. And um, our crab cake, Egg Benedict, which is the yeah. natural go-to. Oh, so, so amazing. So uh, we're, I'm snuggling in here. The pay, the, this place is packed right now. You can hear all the people in the background. Popular place, Jack's at the tracks. Come on down. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I'm having breakfast in just a few minutes. Back to you, Michelle, in the South Shore studio. Well, I'm jealous. I want some chicken and waffles. That sounds great. They also do catering. Um, you can book it for parties, which that'd be a super fun themed party. Kind of do like a throwback, like 50s party or something. Rent out the whole diner. Um, so keep them on your list if you're thinking about hosting a party or, or you want um, some catering done for your next business luncheon or whatever.